What's up? What's up, my ninja warriors? This is the Green Ninja Warrior turn here with Mazing Pokemon or A S O U R U Live. So basically, I'm gonna be using the same RU team that I last time, and I'm gonna try to do like a road to number one thing in RU. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. It should go pretty well, but I'm not sure. And so basically, right now on the ladder, well, I just didn't argue. I just didn't argue battle, which got me a bit higher. Cause I did what, one battle since I done. I've done like one battle since like the last time I recorded. But it got me pretty high. See, for example, I'm already, I'm already like number thirty-one on the ladder with fifteen eighty-five, and then we got seventy-six point nine GXC. See, I'm doing, I'm doing pretty good. And are you not even bad? Like, so yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and look for an RU, RU battle, we'll see how well we do. So we got an uh, interesting looking team. I've never seen Big Roth in RU, so I don't know. I'm not really sure about that thing. Although it looks like Cursed Steel is kind of just sweeps. Yeah, because like, I actually know from previous experience that my Steel steals can easily be Flesh and Dirt, especially with the Cursed Tech. Yeah, the, the rest of Cursed Sleep Talk set actually beats Flesh and Dirt. Which means that my steel can actually set up on like my steel can actually set up on the majority of his team, so I'm actually not really too worried. He also has, my opponent also doesn't have much for Hound Noon, which is cool. So I guess I could lead off with I guess Bronze on. Yeah, I guess I'll lead Bronze on. He leads he leads um Durant, which is okay because I guess I want to steal I mean, maybe not. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go for rocks. Like, do I really need you healthy? Or anything? Not really. I guess I'll just go for rocks. Home claws. Home claws is kind of scary, but like, I mean, Jolteon and Okoze anyways. So who cares? I guess I'll go. Okay, so he's gonna almost Oko me with X Scissor. Again, I don't really. I, I kind of have to sack Bronze on. Like, I have no safe switch in. Besides, I can just I can just revenge this thing with my Jolteon. Yeah, like I can just go into Jolteon and HP ice it. And I don't really care, like, I can just go for the- not HP Ice, can I HP Ice? Nah, I can Shadow Ball, though. Yeah, I can just kill him with Shadow Ball at this point, because Shadow Ball should easily kill from the range of set. Yeah, for sure, like... And he's probably just gonna let Durant die, I mean... Like, what's your switching? I don't understand. Or he could just sack Mesper, or maybe he doesn't know I'm going for Shadow Ball. So he's just basically my post gonna let Mesper die, which is good. That's one. Th that's a pretty decent threat to my team gone. I'm not sure when my opponent did that. I don't know. So now he goes into Vigoroth. Probably know. Probably knowing I'm spent. Although, what does a Vigoroth have for a steal? With? Yeah, I guess I'll set up a steal. I mean, sub. What is this? What the heck? What kind of a Vigoroth is this? Oh, it's Bulka. What if I just spam Curse? No, I'm gonna match. I'm gonna spam Curse. I mean, if he spams Bulka, I'm gonna spam Curse. How does Heavy Slam not break this up, though? Is Vigoroth that, he that heavy? I don't know. I mean... See, like, uh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna spam curse until I can get as much as until, until my Steelix has the same amount of attack as Vigoroth has. Cause I'm not sure what Vigoroth can do to my Steelix. Maybe he has like a fighting coverage move. Maybe he has Earthquake or something like that. But, like even then, Cause Mega, yeah, Mega Steelix has better stats than Vigoroth. Like I can take hits and hit harder. And I might as well spam curse until he stops bulking up. Hmm. I mean, yeah, I think I, I have no switch ins, which means that the only way for, the only way for me to not get swept by Bigger Off is to spam Curse. Yeah, this is kind of a problem. Well, not really. Oh, okay, wait, never mind. Wait, so, was, so apparently Bigger Off's best move to hit me with is Frustration, which means I can easily beat this thing 1v1. And he doesn't have leftovers, which means I can just easily beat it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. So Bigger Off, so still wins versus Bigger Off 1v1. For sure. I, oh no, yes, he gets a crit! Oh, but I, but I also get a crit. 
Ah, uh, crit for crit. Not even bad. And since I'm at plus four defense, pretty sure I just win. Yeah, I think that's game actually, because I can just go for rest here. Yeah, it's game. GG. GG. I think that's GG. Yeah, it's game. As basically, my opponent had nothing for curse mega Felix. And I know I said it during team preview, which is why I was trying to sweep with it so early. Because I knew my opponent didn't have anything he could do to stop Steel from sweeping at all. So yeah, oh my god. Can somebody please ban this thing? Like, this set is too OP. Max HP, max special attack, curse. Like, this thing is like meant for Ubers. Like, come on, let's please ban this thing. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Where am I on the ladder now? So 1503 makes me like... I don't even know what. Where's 1503 even put me in the ladder? We'll see. It probably, make, it probably makes me pretty high in the ladder. Because the last time I checked, I was number 31 in the ladder. So after this battle, I am now number 24 in the ladder. Not even bad. Number 24. If I keep this up, I can get number one easy. Uh, this is actually pretty. This is pretty cool. I just need to keep on at it. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and look for another battle. Yeah, this man's name is Are You is way too easy. Is it? Is Are You really that easy? I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna look for another battle. We'll see how. Can we get the number one in Are You? I think we can. Cause we are Are You legends. We are the Are You lords. And and I I have and we have the. I mean, not we, I mean, I, whatever. I've got the RU Lord squad. So we got a battle against Saiz Berto. Saiz Berto is a pretty solid team. As... I mean, what do you have for a well-played Nasty Pot Mega Houndoom? Like, Mega Houndoom kind of just sweeps my opponent. Like, what do you even have for a well-played Houndoom, like? I can dark pulse this. All I need to do is weaken this, and I can dark pulse it. Oh, it's probably choice scarf. Yeah, it's probably scarf for entry run. So I'm going to watch out for that. Although Mega Steel is kind of beats that. He also, my opponent also doesn't really have any good Tango switch in, so it means that whenever I run Tango, if I can just spam Lee Storm and get a kill, which is actually really good. Which is why I kind of want to lead off with it. I think I'm gonna lead off. I'm gonna lead off Tango. Screw this. Yeah, I might as well, I might as well damage Deoxys right away for my Jolteon. Do I leave Storm or do I... Yeah, I'm not leave Storm. Screw this. It should do a lot. That did a pretty good amount. As he toxics to me. Is my two focus mass kill? Probably. Not. Nah, actually, probably. Please tell me focus mass kill. Does my, does my two focus mass kill? Hopefully it will. I'm gonna go for it. We should hopefully kill him. I don't even know why I'm staying in. But whatever. Actually, it would probably be better to switch down to Bronze on Gator Brox. That's probably the smarter play. Yeah, I don't want to be stupid and stay in. Sneasel comes in. I mean, I could probably live a knockoff and kill him with Gyro Ball. Do I really need your healthy? Not real. Mm. You know, I think I really need Bronze on Healthy for the Mega Steelix. Am I, really, am I really worried about that thing when it's at 38%? Not really, so I'm gonna gyro ball. Okay, goes in Steelix. As he probably wants to get up rocks, which makes sense, although I'm gonna get my own rocks. Yeah, we're gonna exchange rocks here. I'm not, I'm not even gonna try to defog. I'm just gonna go ahead and straight up wreck him as I'm... Goes into Jellison. Do I Toxic? Yeah, I'm gonna Toxic, because if he will lose me, I can heal well. If I need to. Okay, darn it. Taunt is unfortunate, although I'm still gonna tangle if we can get a kill. Because again, yeah, my opponent has no these storm switching, so I can just get a kill. Easy, watch this. Easy kills. And now that the rocks are up, this Dough Fox is gonna be pressured. Because of the stealth rocks being up, which is really good. As well. Like, what is my opponent even supposed to do against this monstrosity? Mm -hmm. Sajberto. Where is Sajberto in the ladder? Sajberto. I don't even care where he is in the ladder. As long as I beat him, I don't even care. Sajberto. So Sajberto. Where's your Aria ranking? Oh, here it is. Oh, wow. Sajberto is a pretty solid ring. Pretty solid. 
record in RU. 61, 63 wins and 27 losses is pretty good. Compared to my... You know, I have 104 wins and 64 losses, which is also pretty good. So he's gonna go to him on top, that's fine. I mean, him on top isn't really the good switch in, like... Yeah, that thing got on, that almost killed him. And I, I kind of want to save. I want to. I want to preserve Tangrowth. I don't. I want Regenerator. Kind of makes me want to switch into Togetic. Yeah, I think Togetic is a safe play. So go to Rapid Spin. Kind of makes me want to Defog. Yeah, I'm gonna Defog. There's no point in having Rocks up if he's just gonna spin them away. I mean, he's probably just gonna go into Mega Steelix anyways. Yeah, Mega Steelix is probably incoming. Or he could just go into this thing. I guess that I guess that also works. As I kinda wanna just go into Steelix, because Steelix can take a hit. Steelix can take a hit any hit from Sneasel pretty easily. I can even take a low kick if I need to. As I guess I'm Mega Evolve and Rest. Cause I kinda wanna conserve Steelix's HP. Yeah, cause I need Steelix healthy for um Tyrantrum, since it's my main Tyrantrum put switch in right now. As I'm just gonna want to tango because again, my opponent has no switch ins. Like, come on, look at this. Him on top's at 19%. Um, Mega St and Steelix is at 34%. And now Sneasel's at 91%. Like, what next? As he actually goes for Hex. Does he outspeed me? He does outspeed me. That's a problem. Oh no, I need. Oh no, I need to preserve me. Actually, if I go into Togetic and Heal Ball, I should be fine. But he has Taunt, so I'm not gonna be fine. At all. This is actually really bad. I have to want to I have to preserve. I have to preserve Tango's health. So I'm gonna go into Jolteon Shadow Ball. Yeah, I think Shadow Ball because he has no good Shadow Ball switches. God, why did I not expect Hex? Okay, Shadow Ball is an okay amount. As yeah, Shadow Ball is a two kill, which is really good. So now he goes into Sneasel, which is apparently a switch in to this thing. Even though it's obviously not. Well, well I guess Steelix is a switch. Yeah, I'm just gonna go into Steelix at this point. I mean, this is kind of unfortunate because. Like, if I, uh, I didn't realize, I'll only, if I can just get rid of Tingle's poison, that'd be nice. Like, if I can just get off a heal bow against, or Togetic, or else, I don't think I can, I don't think I, I don't think I can heal bow against anything, except for him on top, but like, I guess I'll just sleep talk. Del Fox. So I got Heavy Slam, which is pretty good. I said, this is what's going to happen, dude, like, Switcheroo. Well, now my am doing is Choice Scarf. Alright, I guess I'll just go for the Scarf Dark Pulse. Like, there's no reason not to. Yeah, there's really no reason not to Dark Pulse. Like, it hits everything on his team. I'm actually kind of glad that my Hound Doom is Scarfed. Especially if it's, especially if it's Tyrant Doom is Scarfed. Although, it might be Bandit. It's just gonna... My opponent's gonna... I'm assuming that my, my opponent is sacking him on top here. As I guess I'll just go for the, I'm just gonna go for another Dark Pulse. As, yeah, him on top is gonna die this turn, which is good. And I, I, I kinda wanna get rid of him on top here. Like, down goes him on top. Maybe I should've gone to Tick and Heal Bow. Maybe, maybe that would've been a better play. Although, it's whatever. There's, there's, not, there's nothing I can do about that. Unfortunately. As you know, my opponent's now gonna go into Sneasel. Dark Pulse kill. I'm gonna have to count this. So, I'm timid, right? Does Dark Pulse even kill? Houndoom? Oh, you nasty plot. No, you, you nasty plot. No, I'm just gonna say you, you nasty plot. I don't care. Doesn't really matter. Choice Scarf. Dark Pulse versus Sneasel. So he's Life Orb Sneasel. So Dark Pulse is 29 34%. So it's not gonna kill. And he's probably gonna go for Low Kick, right? So. He's gonna go for low kick. And I need Houndoom. Who do I not need? Do I really need Bronzong? 
Eh, not really, I mean... No, screw it, I want a bronze song, I don't need it. Besides, he's probably going for knockoff, and... I mean, Bronzo's probably going to die this turn, but I don't care, I'm just going to work Gyro Ball. But even though I know Bronzo's going to die, like... As long as I can get damage and Sneasel, I'm fine. Because now that Sneasel is in range of, of Houndoom Star Pulse, I can probably sweep with Houndoom late game now. Because yeah, all I need to do sweep of, to sweep with Houndoom would be to get damage in the Tarantrum. And as long as I keep Mega Steelix healthy, I should be fine against that thing. So, I mean... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cause... Mm -hmm. Actually, maybe I should... Maybe I should, maybe I should just go for rocks. Yeah, I think rocks might be better. Yeah, I think stealth rocks are actually better. To go for. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna attempt to go for stealth rocks, because I feel like stealth rocks would help out a lot. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, yeah, yeah, they did. I mean, stealth rocks are definitely helpful. Actually, let me just check something out real quick. Okay. We see something. Is my friend here? No, he's not on yet. Okay, so knock off. So he's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me with knock off. That's what I thought, though. And I'm fine with that because I can just go into Hound Doom. And I guess go for Dark Pulse. Yeah, I'm just going for Dark Pulse. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go for Dark Pulse because it's gonna take out the Sneasel. And my opponent doesn't really have any good Dark Pulse switches left. I mean, my, my, opponent's, best, my opponent's best chance of winning would have to be with, with Tyrantrum. I think Tarantrum is the biggest threat to me right now. And I don't want him going for Earthquake. So, like, if he goes into Steelix, I kind of want to go into Robotech, expecting to, to in, lock himself. Expecting him to lock himself into Earthquake. Since it's the only thing that can really kill Steelix and. I want to do Super Super Power. And why would he go for Super Power? Like, I don't know. So, he's going to go into Tarantrum. And the thing here. What's my best possible play? Like. See, like, mm, I think I'm gonna go to Togetic, he's probably gonna Earthquake. Yeah, he's going for, he's gonna go for Earthquake, isn't he? Ah, uh, yeah, predicted! I knew he would do that. And now he's gonna go into either Steelix or Delphox. Which is kind of why I want to double Steelix. I can double now and do him here, because I know he's gonna switch out. What?! Oh my god! Is he not Scarf? Huh? What? So he's not Scarf, that makes no sense. Like, isn't your team too slow then? I mean, I guess it's Delphox's Scarf, he's probably banded. But he can't be banded, but is he Life Orb then? He's gotta be Life Orb, I mean... Does, does HP Ice from Jolteon kill? Cause like... Mm, is it worth it to go into Jolteon HP Ice? No, it's not. Actually, how long have I- how long have I been asleep for? How long have I been asleep for? I think I'll, I've only used to talk once, right? Yeah, I've only used to talk once. So I still have one more turn of sleep, because I only used I only to talk once after going for rest. Guys, right, so I guess I'll go into Jolteon. No, I think Tink. He's probably in Hex, though. Ooh, but Jojan's burned. Shoot. I guess I'll sleep talk. Yeah, I knew Hex. Oh my god, he crits me! No way, I misclick. Fudge. Shoot. I guess I'll want a Jolteon. Oh my god, this is huge. So it's a taunt. Of course he crits my Steelix. I guess I'll just go for Shadow Ball. Like, finally, Steelix dies. Or at least... He still gets two killed, which is nice. 
The steel is gonna get two killed, which is good. Oh my god. So now I just shadow ball again. And what's this? He has no switches now. Let's see, game plan, game plan. Oh, if he goes in the tournament, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shadow ball. I'm gonna say in shadow ball. Cause I, I need to get damage in this thing. Oh wait, Houndoom's dead, which is bad though. Yeah, the fact that Houndoom is dead though is really bad. I think Jolt has my win condition now, unfortunately. It's gonna have to be my win condition at this point. As unfortunately, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to sack Togetic, I think. Yeah, I think sacking Togetic. Oh my god, maybe, maybe I should have just kept Bronzong around. Then again. But then, like, every single time I bring Bronzong, this comes in. But then I can Toxic pull this Pokemon. Although I didn't get to do that. Mm. Oh shoot, he's actually running Dragon Dance. I haven't seen that thing in forever. I haven't seen Dragon Dance in that thing in a while. I forgot to even learned Dragon Dance. And I'm probably gonna lose now, aren't I? Yeah, I guess. Mm, shoot, of course, you, of course people still run Dragon Dance. GG, unfortunately. That's gonna be a game, unfortunately. Oh well. It's gotta be the first Dragon Dance tournament from ever. Maybe not ever, but like. I don't know. I did not expect that thing. I did not expect that to be a thing. And now I've dropped. And my GC is now only 26. Damn it. Uh, Jellicent with Taunt and Taunt with Taunt and Willow has been hex is such a problem. Why does every single team in the tier have, have Jellicent? I don't think I've ever had a battle in, in RU where I haven't faced a Jellison ever. This is crazy. You know, I'm gonna look at my YouTube because I'm awesome. It's been deserting on my YouTube. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm using I'm using this music for for um, my video, by the way. The Mount Pyro Summit remix. Let me let me link my YouTube real quick. Let me link my YouTube real quick. My YouTube Mm. My YouTube. Okay. So I think I'm gonna lead off of Tangrope actually, because he has no switches for Tangrope and it can destroy everything turn one, and why not? As at least Scrafty, which is fine. I'm just gonna focus blast. I don't really care. I mean, focus blast, focus blast should destroy him. Straight up. Yeah, so what does he have for Nasty Bar Houndoom? Like, doesn't Nasty Bar Houndoom kind of just... I mean, yeah, because Nasty Bar Houndoom kind of just wins. Maybe that... that I mean, his, his, his x file might be Scar. Though, but even if it is... So he goes to Dragon Dance, which is fine. Please land. Ah, of course. Of course you miss, you useless piece of garbage. <sighs> Sigh. I guess I'll go I guess I'll go into Toby Tick. Since I have to. Even though I'm probably gonna lose now. Yeah, I think I just lost. Yeah, I lose now. Don't I? I'm pretty sure. And knock out the crazy damage, although I guess he is life for. Is Dragon and Scrappy a speed jolt gem though? I don't think so. All I need- Okay, switches out. Okay, cool. That's cool, the fact that you would actually switch out. As I guess I want a bronze on and get a rocks. Yeah, because rocks are going to be huge. Because all- It means his Pokemon are going to continuously take damage just by switching in. Which is kind of huge. For sure. Shoot, he goes to Shadow Ball. Nice predict. And he gets Ah, uh, lucky players these days. Sigh. I just hate lucky players these days. They get so lucky. And they get spit out drops like that. So Shadow Ball's not gonna do much to Hound Doom. I guess I was Nasty Plot. Like, what does he have for Nasty Doom? 
Just show me your nasty, nasty doom counter. Like that. Let's see. Let's see. Death fodder. Death fodder. Death fodder. Death fodder. Death fodder. Death fodder. Equals GG. <clears throat> like, what are you supposed to do? You go ahead. You go ahead and sack your entire team to nasty plot like for pound doom. Ah, uh, Clefairy the counter, who takes like a billion percent from the plus two fire blast. As long as I don't miss, I should be good. Nice, I land it. Gone! Ah, <laughs> uh, Clefairy the Houndoom counter. Ah, uh, let's go. Ah. Uh, nice. Nice and Houndoom food. Yummy. <coughs> Wait, is this Melo a scarf? Because. Is Scarf Melo a thing? Maybe. And he probably is close combat. Since he's probably scarf for close combat. It's probably close. Actually, never mind. Cancel, cancel. I'm gonna have Dark Pulse. Hey, Dark Pulse is gonna kill Meloetta. <clears throat> oh my god. Houndoom just wins. Houndoom wins. Ah, free Houndoom food. GG. Ah, nice and Houndoom sweep. Don't you just love it when Houndoom sweeps your, empire, your opponent's entire team? As we are at 26 minutes, which is pretty good. I want to keep on going. Let's make this a long live, so just, just so we can get pretty high in the ladder. Yo, let's see how high in the ladder we can get. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have another game. Just screw this. So today is Friday. We all love Friday, don't we? Come on. Why am I getting so off topic? Okay, so we got a game. Ah, nice and jolty on so my opponent has a Doug Trio. Why is Doug Trio kind of an issue for this team? Because it kind of traps this and this. But I've dealt with it before. Like all I really need to do is get up rocks and it should be good. So I kinda wanna lead a I kinda wanna just lead a bronze on because of rocks. I don't know, I kinda wanna do that. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, screw it. At least Doug Trio, which is fine, because Doug Trio can't touch me and I'm going for rocks. I'm just going for rocks. Doug Trio can't really kill my bronze zone at all. Yeah, he goes to rocks, which is fine. I don't care. You can go ahead and rock me all you want. And he goes to Memento. Okay, as what's he gonna go into though? Maybe maybe Venomoth. Just cause set. But like I have sped up steel, which kinda counters Venomoth. Like I don't really care about Venomoth, because I have a uh, Spadef Skeletz, which totally counters Venomoth in every which way. See, so, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna my Spadef Skeletz, which totally beats Venomoth, because I'm just gonna like evolve and curse. As he put, goes to put me, as my opponent's gonna put me to sleep, which is fine. As I'm just gonna sleep talk, hopefully I get the Heavy Slam, that'll be cool. I get Curse, which is also fine. I mean, I'm fine with Curse. I don't really care about the fact, because like, I'm pretty sure Baton Pass is illegal, so yeah. Why did I wake up? Oh my god, I can't believe it. I didn't realize I, wo I, didn't realize I woke up there. Shoot. I just messed up my Steelix. Damn it. And now I'm gonna have to watch out for Steelix. Hmm. I messed up. Shoot. Why did I mess up so badly? Bug Poison. I guess Bronzong comes in gerbils. Hopefully, miss sleep powder. Cause you can't be that lucky. Like you have to miss sleep powder. Mm. Ah, sigh. Lucky players. And I stay asleep. Oh my god, wake up! God. Okay, at least I wake up for second turn. Can you please miss sleep powder? Please. Please miss sleep powder. Oh my god, lucky players! <sighs> sigh. Sigh. Lucky player.
So unfortunately, my opponent is super lucky, and they, my opponent, my opponent is so super lucky, and he won't miss a single sleep, and he won't miss a single sleep powder. So unfortunately, I'm gonna lose. No, the only, the only reason I lost actually is because I, I, I misclicked. I have to go for another battle. I'm looking for another battle. Can't believe I miscounted sleep turns. I must, because I can't believe I just woke up and then I thought I only had one turn of sleep. I swear I had only had one turn of sleep there. I don't know. Um. Still need. Okay, wait. To heal yourself. Okay, so that I finally, I finally have a battle. Okay. Wow, my opponent has a timer on me. How lame. Just kidding. <laughs> now I see why how I'm doing completely wrecks this man. Teflosion, uh, of course you lose Teflosion. Do I go Hound Doom? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Hound Doom, because he's probably not. But, uh, wow, lucky players. Of course he lands Fogus last. So unfortunately he's gonna predict Hound Doom. Shoot, that's bad, because I needed Hound Doom. I can't believe my opponent just risked that. Like, what if I want, what if I say it and went for EQ? Like, it's such a risky play. And why did he stay? Does this man not know that Bronze Bronze Song beats Teflosion easy? I'm just gonna go for another Earthquake. Cause he has no switches to Earthquake that are good. Yeah, my, my opponent has no Bronze Song switches. Like, Bronze Song kinda walls his entire team. Which is kinda crazy. Like Flygon is not a switch in. I don't understand. Like, I'm just gonna for rocks. Like you can switch in Flygon if you want to, I guess. Like, I'm just gonna set up my rocks real quick. Real quick. Go ahead, you Do you really think U turn is gonna. What's the point of bringing Flygon if you're just gonna U turn? I don't understand. Okay, you can bring. Oh, so he's just gonna bring in Fly. He's just gonna bring in Teflosion again. That's, that's, that's actually kind of a problem, because I have to sack my entire team to this. Why do I have to sack my entire team just to win? This is ridiculous. I guess I'll just go to Togetic. Flamethrower actually does a lot. I'm just gonna spam roost. Yeah, I might as well spam roost until he runs out of flamethrowers and until he gives up. Ah, Sai, lucky play. Slash data flamethrower. I can't believe he landed a flamethrower. Ah, this man's so lucky. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, who the heck lands flamethrower? Like, doesn't flamethrower miss all the time? Like, oh my god. <clears throat> Of course you crit me. I think I- yeah, I have to have Dazzling Gleam, I think. Why do I just- I have to sack Togetic, unfortunately. Guys, I guess I want to Jolteon Shadowball. Why do I have nothing for Typhlosion? This team is way too Typhlosion. Maybe I should just give you Earthquake, because I don't know. Maybe I just got- maybe I'm just getting lucky with Steel. I don't know. I'm not sure about this. I, I mean, I guess I can just go and destroy him with Tangro. Tangro kind of destroys him, which is good. Of course, you crit me. I could least storm here, but it's too obvious. Yeah, least storm is too obvious. I'm gonna HP fire because he has Bronze on the Magneton and Bruzion. Like, why is it not a two KO? Whatever. He might have Focus Blast. He has Focus Blast, doesn't he? He has, does not have Focus Blast. I could have stayed in then. And he goes to close combat. Maybe he thought I would stay in. I mean, maybe that, he probably predicted Bronze only. Maybe not. 
I could have stayed in with kill the way she fire. Sigh. I guess I'll just kill my Jolteon now. Like as long as all I mean if I if as long as all my opponents jo Jolteon counters die. I'm gonna HP Ice real quick. Let me hit my opponent up with HP Ice. Oh Morgan HP nice. Oh No, I'm gonna HP Ice actually. <gasps> yeah, I'm trying to HP Ice. Maybe this team maybe this team isn't as good as I thought it was. I don't know. I guess it's not. Oh my god! Oh my god, he brings in Fly Gohan! Did my opponent just choke away the entire game? I think my opponent, I think my opponent just choked away the entire game. Because now my opponent doesn't have anything. Yeah, because now I can just go into Chain Growth and fire a Fully Storm and then destroy everything. Although, Toxic. That kind of sucks though. I mean, Toxic kind of sucks, but like, I'm gonna fire off a Leaf Storm, screw this. You may predict me to over predict again. Or we can just go right to Magneton, that's fine. That's definitely a Violate. What's he gonna do though, like, I guess Flash Cannon or Thunderbolt. I'm just gonna go to Jolteon. I'm gonna go into Jolteon, just take the Flash Cannon. I guess I'll Shadow Ball, I mean, it's a spec Shadow Ball, so it's gonna hurt. As he stays in, goes for Flash Cannon, as Jolteon, Magneton is now gone, done for. Like, Magneton's probably gonna, Magneton's gonna die this turn. Yeah, he's gonna Magneton die, that's what I thought. Now Magneton's gone, which is good. Uh, perfect. Now I just want to tank growth. See, the problem is, the problems are kind of a problem to me. Dragon Power. I'm just a Giga Drain, screw this. See, he goes in a Bronze on, which is fine. We'll see, his his Bronze on does not have leftovers, it's good to know. I'm still going to Steelix. Steelix, 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 I mean, oh my god, I can't even speak, I'm sorry. Steelix can probably set up in Bronze on. Yeah, because, like, Curse, Mega Steelix can, like. Yeah, unless he's, like, some weird setup, Bronze on, I don't know. Maybe he is. Maybe he's offensive bronze on. He is, isn't he? Yeah, he's probably offensive bronze on then. I'm just gonna make a ball curse. So I think I can actually beat this beat this bronze on 1v1. So he goes in the gastrodon, maybe knowing that. How could you have known that though? Alright, so my opponent's actually gonna forfeit. Perfect. I mean my opponent, my opponent's gonna leave. Right, so I get another one. You know, I'm gonna get one more game and then I'm gonna off and off the live. Now I need more wins. We need more wins. High ladder is too good. I'm just kidding. I can do this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my opponent's not coming back. And maybe that, I should probably do another are you ladder with, with like someone else that I know. Yeah, because like um, Okay, so do I, mm. I'm pretty sure this battle is won. Come on, hopefully I find uh, hopefully I find an RU battle before I die. At least another RU battle before I die. Cause I'm just gonna look for one more. Why do I why do I only get plus seven? No. It's probably because my opponent's low on the ladder, isn't it? Because my opponent too, was too easy to beat, I guess. I don't know. Mm. Bum, bum, bum. So, uh, why am I still looking for a battle with this garbage? 
Mom, please tell me I found one soon. No, are you about what's going on right now? Oh my god. I'm, I might be looking for a while. We got, you know, I'm, you know what, guys? I think I'm gonna have, I'm gonna end off the live right here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna end off the live, and I'm, I'm probably gonna end up doing some. I might do some laddering off screen, just to see how, how high I can get in RU. I don't know. Maybe I should. Is that a good, is that a good idea? Probably. Cause fourteen seventy one is okay. I mean, where am I? I'm actually number 15 in the ladder now, which is kind of unfortunate because I was like higher, higher, higher in the ladder before. Oh, that's fine. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed today's RU Live, make sure to go ahead and smash that like button, and I'll see you guys next time.